body temperature is 40. Okay, so the normal is, oh, and there's the blood. Eight-year-old Safi has been brought into the Bondi Referral Hospital sash after losing a huge amount of blood. And she's blind, you said? She went totally blind last year. Susie is babysitting Safi while her owner is overseas. She's been like a surrogate mum to the little Shih Tzu since she was a pup. I know her mum is devastated. It won't surprise me if she just gets the next plane back. I don't know what she'll do. That's some serious bleeding from her rectum. All right, we just need to do a blood count and make sure uh, how anemic she is. Check if she needs a transfusion. All right, baby. Good girl. There are a few conditions which could be causing Safi to bleed from her bowel. Now, one possibility is ulcers, another is inflammatory bowel disease or an infection. Those are all treatable. Another cause is cancer, and that would be the worst possible diagnosis. Wow, that is seriously anemic. So that's the amount of red blood cells. It's normally, it should be heading up towards the halfway mark. Eight-year-old Safi is hemorrhaging blood. Test results have confirmed she's in a critical condition. So she's got a blood count of 14%. Normal for a dog is above 37%. She needs a transfusion right now. Only a few months ago, a rare disease robbed the Shih Tzu of her eyesight. Now she faces an even tougher battle. This blood transfusion is going to make her feel better, but it is just a short-term fix. We need to work out what's causing this hemorrhage if we have any chance of saving her life. As the transfusion starts, Susie has to face up to calling Safi's owner in Europe. I mean, I know it's not my fault, but it's not the news you want to tell somebody. You know, it's her baby and and she just loves it a bit. I'm gonna have a sleep now, Bobby. Good girl. Eight-year-old Safi is in a critical condition after losing a huge amount of blood. Bowel cancer could definitely cause the symptoms that Safi's had, so I'm really hoping that's not what we find. An endoscopy is basically a fibre optic cable with the camera on the end and we can use that to put down Safi's throat into her stomach and also up her back end to have a look at her colon. This is a really big concern. The lining of the intestine is looking really quite lumpy and irregular. It should be really smooth and, and even and doesn't look very good at all. More abnormalities are found, and now the biopsies will be sent for analysis. We didn't see any obvious tumours or polyps or anything like that. She's got through the procedure okay, and now we just have to keep our fingers crossed. She's up here. Oh, hello, gorgeous. Safi's distraught babysitter Susie is now finding it hard to cope. Nothing seems to be straightforward, it just seems to be endless tests. And maybe not even good results at the end. That's what I'm really worried about. I know it's not my dog. And in some ways it makes it worse. Hey Mel, you know why she looks so good? Why? Because it's not cancer. Oh, that's so hey. exciting. That's good. At Sash, it's great news for Safi. The little Shih Tzu was in a critical condition when she was rushed in, bleeding dramatically from the bowels. Yeah. Wanna go home? Wanna see Susie? Hey? The most probable cause of Safi's hemorrhaging was either something that she's eaten or a really bad infection. It's such a relief that Safi doesn't have cancer. The poor little dog has been through so much with her blindness and other health issues and it's such great news for Susie and the rest of the family that Safi's gonna be okay. Hey, there's my little Safi. Hello, lovely kid. Hello. Oh, look who's here. Look who's here, lovely. It's just been too much and we're just really, really, really excited that she's coming home again at last. Susie and her four-legged family will continue to look after the rejuvenated patient.
All the other little doggies were so excited to see her at the gate and jumped all over and give her lots of kisses and gave her a huge welcome. Safi, there you go. As for Safi's owner, she's on a plane heading back home. It's a great relief. We're really, really happy. It's fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. Oh, one nice big family again. Yes. Oh, big kiss. Big kiss, kiss. If you guys loved that video, great. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel below. That way.